Okay. Are you going to ask me questions? Is that it? This is my nurse. This is the one I told you all about. She, my mom called today, and my mom said, you have an angel tonight as your nurse. This is before I had really talked to her. Now I see why. So I wanted you all to meet her, too. Hi. I'm, I'm the nurse tonight, um, taking care and just making sure that everything goes well in here and that comfort is our main goal. And how do you feel about sickle cell patients and what we have to go through sometimes? Well, as we talked about earlier, I've, I've seen a lot of sickle cell patients and I feel like they have to fight to get healthcare people to believe that they hurt as badly as they do. And so, you know, we as healthcare workers tend to hold back and we don't want to give enough pain medication because we question. Well, how could anybody need that much pain medication and be sitting here and talking and acting like a normal person? Um, and what a lot of nurses don't understand is that people who have been on pain, in pain for so long, they don't show it the same way mm -hmm. as someone who is having an acute episode of pain for the first time in their life. Mm -hmm. They're going to ride, they're going to make a lot of, lot of noises, and they're going to look mm -hmm. like they're in pain. Sickle cell patients don't always look like they're in pain. Mm -hmm. We have to believe their pain and treat it accordingly. And I'm, I'm just a big believer in that. So I appreciate what sickle cell patients are going through. Wow. What would you have to say to the patients that's never had a good nurse? Well, I hope they've had good nurses and the nurses just didn't show them how good they are because I think there's a lot of good nurses out there. Um, but if they have a nurse that just doesn't understand pain, I think asking them to look at your blog would be an excellent idea. Um. Um, and to read the experts on pain. Yes. There are some, Margot McCaffrey is an excellent, excellent writer about pain. And she says pain is what the patient says it is. Yes. Not what we as nurses decide. Yes. Um, because we can't possibly crawl inside and know. And we don't want to crawl inside. Yes. We be shocked, I think. Yes. So okay, thank you so much. You're welcome. And tell them if there's good luck, there are good nurses out there. There are. There are. And there's many more coming because there's a lot more education going on about pain. Mm -hmm. and you have to be your own advocate and you have to fight for it. And then if you don't get through to it, then you have to get your doctor to be on your side and he has to really come down and say, look, nurses, I want this much pain medication and don't worry about it and teach people. Well, um, getting angry at the nurses isn't going to help. We well, just have to understand where they're coming from mm -hmm. and what their fear is. And mm -hmm. their fear is that they're contributing to somebody who is an addict. Mm -hmm. We just have to teach them that's not what's happening. Wow. Well, wow. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> All right. Good night. All right.